Hey guys, it's Jean the Diabetic Queen, and today we will be switching out for the Dexcom G6, a sensor and transmitter. Before we get started, we want to check our blood so we make sure it's at a good level. And then we want to go to settings and press stop sensor, stop, and then press home and it should say new sensor. And then you want to rip your old one off. Let me see the inside of it. You get that off, you want to flip it around and break this thing off. And then you want to pull that out. And then you want to this and open it. I need to do it on my legs. So then you get an alcohol wipe. Make sure it's nice and clean. You wipe the area that you'll be doing. Okay. okay. Actually, you press new sensor. Enter code. Take photo. And then you can just hold that there and it will automatically take it. And then you Take this off, wait for it to dry. Take this off. And you stick it, or I guess you take the safety stuff off, and then you stick it on there, and then all you do is press the button. And one, two, three. And then you wanna uh, do this three times. One, two, three. And then we want to get this and peel this. And then this. Get that out. And you're going to put this. Make sure this end goes in here first. And then you make sure it clicks twice. Okay. And then you go to settings. You press. Transmitter. Transmitter. And you go pair new and enter code. Take photo. Take photo and then and it'll automatically take the photo. And then you want to take a photo. It should be on the box. It should be right here. And then that will automatically take the photo next and then I will search for the transmitter we've waited about five minutes and now it has found it and now you want to press start sensor and it will take about two hours to restart okay guys that's all for the video so and if you have any problems with it comment down below or what is recommended call Dexcom okay that's all for this video see ya please like and subscribe